Hello everyone, and welcome back to Endling. Extinction is forever. Where we are here with our three little cubs and their very hungry bellies as we are getting ready to wake up for another night roaming around our new territory, unfortunately located next to a human factory, and trying to figure out if we're going to be able to keep everybody alive long enough to make the most of this this territory as well as figure out what has happened to our missing cub so so far we've actually explored quite a bit of land and it looks like our path is still blocked in several areas the badger has actually moved though so we might go ahead and explore because the badger is quite close what he is up to and see if any new paths have potentially opened up to the north but then there is a path down to the south we have not yet explored so hopefully poking our noses around and giving that all a good sniff will provide us with at least a lead on a little bit of food because our cubs are getting so hungry and it's very hard to find a lot of food here. And we need to keep an eye out for predators, which is not the best. But that badger did have a stinky old fish with him. So I'm hoping maybe if we follow him now that he has crossed the way, we might stumble on something else. Or if that... All right, what's going on over here? Oh, he's been trapped. All right, we can fix this. All right, so he has been freed. There you go, buddy. But I wonder what that might lead for us. All right, let's see. Is the trash potentially available as more food? I'm not finding anything. Oh, wait. Okay, it looks like the trash has been refilled, which is terrible, but also possibly really important to feed everybody. I hate to feed them this junk, but that's literally all we had here. Ah, oh, dang it. All right, let's see. Anything else? The badger's been freed. I think I saw at some point some berry bushes. Oh, I think I heard something actually. All right, all right. Was that a mouse? somewhere nearby? Did I spook it off? Because I really need to find it. The three of these little cubs get so much hungrier, so much faster than I was anticipating. Oh, I could have sworn I heard a mouse. All right, let's see what we've got. Maybe up here? Please, maybe something up here. Some fruit? Wait, is there a person over here? No, but there is some fruit. Okay. So we've got to go around this, but otherwise... Thank goodness, at least there's something to offer them. I'll let them go ahead and eat in the bush. So I was right, there was at least one spot, and there's the tree that the owl was on the other day. So we want to be really cautious about that. Okay, there you are, you three. Hang on. I think maybe I could break this and make a new trail. There we are. Come on. So that has actually changed things over here so we can get around a little bit easier. I guess I'm the one who's supposed to be opening up all of the trails. I thought I was just patiently waiting. <gasps> a bunny! Oh my gosh. Okay, I've got to be really careful. This is not... That's right, there was a rabbit here. Oh, she saw me. But what if we wait in here? Yes! Oh my goodness! Okay, a little a little aggressive, but that's a lot of food. Please tell me that's more than just... Yes! Look at the hatch! Oh, what a relief! That was a ton of food for our little ones. Well, now we can actually spare a moment to do a bit more exploring and see if we're able to find another spot to get them more food. I think there was a human over here, but maybe they've gone. 
And actually, if I wiggle down here... A bird egg! And, let's see, can I teach my cubs to do this? Or is it gonna have to be me? Can I, can I shake this bird egg down somehow? Hmm. So it doesn't look like I can get the bird egg down, unfortunately. There's a teddy bear in here. Ah. Ah, that egg. It definitely is not going to be easy to reach. All right, it's time to go ahead, whoops, and head back home. We'll go this route just in case. Oh, there's fish over here. Oh, thank goodness. Okay. Maybe I can go ahead. It's probably not very good for them, but... All right, quickly. If you all are full fed, then we can probably be a little safer exploring tomorrow. Good. Now let's get home. I've got to keep an eye out on the trees for that owl. Oh, and now that it's morning, the people are going to be out. All right, come on, you three. We need to get back to the house as quickly as possible. Or the lair, I should call it. Okay, here. This is where we go. Oh, thank goodness. Safe. I really thought someone was going to sneak up on us this time. But there we are. Hmm. Day after day. How many more scents do we have? Several. I guess right now is all about use your cub skills whenever they are available. They will help you survive. I would love to. I just need to figure out how to teach my cub skills. Oh! Oh, so many things have changed. Okay. Well then, let's go up to the north. The cubs are... Oh! Oh! It's their brother's scent. Where'd it go? Did I run past the thing? No, it's this way. Alright, come on. I think they are getting bigger, too. It could just be my imagination, though. I know I'm working them hard to make them keep up with all of this. Oh, I should be checking for the owl. Let's not get too ahead of ourselves, little ones. Just a bit further. So did he come up here after the fisherman rejected him? Alright, and where did that lead? Hmm. I'm really curious about what could be going on up to the north, so I do want to check that out, but... Alright. Alright, there we are. So what do we have right here? It broke in! And recently, too, because this was locked recently. Okay. I think we need to watch out because I think there's a guard dog around here. Or there used to be. Okay. Did he destroy this drone? With a gun? Okay, that's getting a little bit more risky. And there's another piece way over there. I don't want to... I don't want to run too fast, because I'm worried if I do, we'll leave our little ones behind. So, we can go that way, but I don't know if that's going to lead us the right direction. No, this way. Okay. Up here. What is- oh, did he go inside the building? Is this- is this maybe a factory where- medicine was made? I mean, he must be ridiculously strong to be able to climb with all of that. That's- that's absolutely- There he is! Oh my gosh! Okay! Alright, oh, there's a little bit of trash over here. Again, not what I would like to feed my- my little ones, but... They're getting hungry. And we've got to do what we can do. 
I'm sorry that it's only this little ones. Please don't get... Oh, dang it. Okay, we've got the bag stuck on our heads. But as much as I hate it, I feel like that's the risk we have to run. And there's more food somewhere over here. And it's going to be important to explore and see if we can find a way in over here, too. Do I smell? Yeah, there it is. Ah, oh, there. A rat. Where did it go? Got it. I don't like feeding them this, but at least it'll offer. Oh, there's a lot of there's a lot of rats over here. Oh, oh, but there's also a person. Okay, so we need to be careful. But it does look like there's a person over there. And there's somebody over here too. If we can get inside, maybe we'll be able to find another spot to run to. Oh. Okay. So I could use a cub over here if they had the skill to be able to push that open, but I don't know what that would require of me. Is there a new lair? Or is this just... What are they making here? Alright, I think that there's people down here? What are they making here? people here. So they're manufacturing something. I don't know what it is, and we don't have time to be able to to linger, I don't think. Alright. Come on, little ones. The flip side of all this is that there's more food sources here. Oh, there's a person. Alright, I think it's time we, we, we went home. Are they still manufacturing things? That's a lot of humans we've seen. And a lot of the other ones we've seen so far are sick. Alright, we should be able to get home. Come on. Come on. I'm so glad we were able to find a bunny and a rat. But if you think about it, like a bunny, a rat? We fed them so much food and they're still so hungry. Oh, I'm so nervous about making sure they, they have enough to eat. I think starvation is ironically going to be one of our biggest dangers. I am keeping an eye out for any owls or hawks for predation, though. Come on, little ones, we need to run a little bit faster than that. Oh, the people are starting to come out. Okay, let's go. What is he doing? I wonder if he was really hungry, and because we took... Come on, come on. Almost there. And because we took the badger away and freed it... Come on. You guys are almost here. You've... Scary. Scary. Made it. Ooh. Okay. I've really got to teach them more skills. I think the cub skills are going to become increasingly important. <gasps> oh no, what's this? Oh, our little lair. Okay. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a lot of chunks of something that just fell down. Oh my gosh. This way, this way. So that guy is just roaming around right outside our home. All right, that's not gonna bode well. All right, come on, you three. Oh, I wonder if we can find a new lair. This is probably going to get a little bit more complicated now that the humans have a reason to really be poking around. So, let's see if we can find a new way in. And first things first, as, as hard as it is to just turn our backs on the fact a giant building or sign has just fallen on our home, we are going to want to go ahead and make sure... Is this the path? Not quite this one right here. 
we're gonna want to make sure that we are fed first so here we go guys if you guys could do please leave a like for our mother fox and her three little ones dust coconut and ember and if you'd like to join us on this oh and how i wish we could we could climb that and get that little egg and if you would like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures do please consider subscribing but most importantly stay curious and i'll see you guys next time bye bye